this. One calorie. What up? Epic! What up? It's like 9 a.m. for you. How are you, man? 
You're like there from the start. The opposite of what you said. So thank you so much. Cloud, run like the wind. <laughs> what is up? We're going for 27K today. Very tired, I may fall asleep on my couch, but I'm here. Hey man, really appreciate it. Having a coffee, not a Nicaragua pour over, but a Costa Rica flat white this time. Nice. Getting fancy. Yeah, I looked at the at the world clock. Not yet. I'll hold out best I can though. So like Montreal and London are now four hours apart. Epic are young London time. Probably right. The UK must be one time zone. Yeah, so it's funny how we don't change time uh, on the same day. Yeah. <laughs> how about you, Cloud? Is it... Uh, Usually we're 13 hours apart. Did you change time last night? It's it's 5.09 here. Oh, and by the way, uh, I change my settings for posting links. We don't change time. I never understood that daylight saving until recently. Are you serious? Oh, that's really cool. So like, now we're 12 hours apart. If it's five here, now it's 5 p.m. for you. That's cool. So I changed the permissions for posting links. So if you don't mind, Cloud, it's fine. If you don't mind trying, basically if you post a link from a random website, it should block it. But if you post a clip, it should work now. Thank you so much ah. <laughs> all right now well it looks like even Google wasn't blocked so I hope you don't get like timed out Because, like, I think that's what happens. Okay, so you can post. You can post clips. Well, it looks like you can post pretty much anything. And I changed the Be Right Back and starting songs. So, it should be a bit more chill.
NC, the stream development. <laughs> Thank you. I moved the chat over here because it was hard. It was getting hard to read sometimes. But I find that the the camera I'm using is is a bit fuzzy. Magnificent clumsy sriracha dog face is probably the best meta tag I've ever read. Long. <laughs> That would be a pretty cool band name. Magnificent Clumsy Sriracha Dog Face. this the camera is pretty fuzzy it's the best thing about twitch huh? <laughs> so like if the running streams become more of a permanent thing I may consider a breading that cam too because that used to be like my my main camera but I think it doesn't do uh, depth very well FPS. I'll let you know suggestions if I ever think of any too for these running stream. Thank you. Would well, be really cool but a bit insane is if I get like in, I think one of the things I enjoy most about streaming was thinking of formats and designs. Yeah. And like, you're good at it. I was thinking that why use a nice 4K camera on a 70, 20p stream when it's in the tiny corner and you have your running stream at full size. Yeah, yeah, but the... Uh, oh no, you're reading my message, cut off what you were originally saying. Ah, uh, it's okay. No worries. Yeah, I know what you mean, Epic, but... The 4K camera... Uh, it's not really only about resolution, it's about like having autofocus and a high frame rate. And also, that's where I work. So all my video conferences. Yeah. No worries, I'll get back to it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Cloud, your, I, like your intro is super chill and, and like the, the montage that you have there. It's really cool like makes me want to do more than just a a still image for starting soon and be right back be nice to have a good library of clips to to run through for the be right back but yeah I have a little list of things yeah, but you're moving a lot in this camera. Probably doesn't mean much sitting 
at a desk with the other camera. <laughs> yeah, w what I was saying is that uh, it still makes it makes a difference, and on my video conference for work is at the desk. So I'm I'm not gonna remove it. Like it it, it also detects the green screen better. Like the camera above the TV here is really basic and old. So I would just eventually upgrade that one too. So what would be crazy is if I get in good enough shape so that I can run like a whole marathon every Sunday under like under four hours actually like probably I'd need to run them in three and a half hours or else I would bust the 8 a.m. unless I wake up 30 minutes even earlier So that's what I was going to say, Cloud. We're all cut up. This setup is super cool. Thank you. 25k a few months ago. No. A marathon is 42. A half marathon is 21. You're thinking miles. I think, I think uh, a marathon is 23.1 miles. Ah, uh, that must be it, yeah. Also because we're doing more than 25k today, I'm just drinking water and uh, every 9k I'll pop one of those running gels. This is serious. So how was uh, Elden Ring yesterday? You played a lot? Epic? Yeah, it's been good, man. Some good progress. I'm at like 75 hours played. Well, that's a lot. Wow. Are you close to being done or not? Not even. It's a big one. Nice. How about you, Cloud? Did you ever finish that bartending game? Because like, Every time I watch you, 
you advance like two minutes of the game, the rest is just chatting. <laughs> It's not a bad thing. No, still three major bosses left and two regions left yet to discover and map, not including the underground areas. And that game looks huge, huge. Alright, so that bartending game is actually one of my favorites and I finished it quite a lot. But I left it for over a year and don't remember the story. Decided to play it to show other people why I love it so much. That's really cool. It is a cool game. I looked it up and it's not on PlayStation though. It's so on PC and Switch. Yeah. Yeah, I may still try it out sometime. It's a really simple game, but you do kind of do pottery and drag around tricks. Have you heard of Necro Barista? Similar type thing, I believe. I don't know which one of the two. What is this? Looking it up right now. I know that Ed Placencia was playing a bartender game at some point. Or a barista game. I'm not sure. It looked cool. Last night, I did not eat like a maniac and I did not drink alcohol in a short while, in a couple of days, so the heart rate should be better today. I haven't played it myself, but it's the game I think of when you're playing your one. I keep thinking Valhalla is something else. Looks really interesting, Epic. Thanks for telling me about it. Nice. Title hookup. Hope you have a better run this time. Yeah. Should be a breeze. Like the, the goal is to stay in that second zone the whole run. If I succeed, then we'll put it faster next time. But I'll be away next week between Friday and Sunday. So the next running stream will be in two weeks. I'm going to go uh, ski in the States with uh, four really old friends. Yeah. Set a line for 9 a.m. again. Didn't want to leave you hanging for a couple hours running, potentially alone. Never experienced snow. Thank you so much, Epic. 
and cloud. Like I really, really appreciate it and I hope, I hope it wasn't too hard, man, because, you know, I don't want you ending up. Yeah, Epic is the best, for sure. I, I don't want you to have like a crappy day, especially that we change time zones. Um, so between ages eight and 12, I used to do, I used to be on a ski racing team. So that's like uh, 25 years ago. Yeah. And the four guys that I'm going with were on the racing team with me. You said you were starting earlier. Thought you were gonna be an hour in when I got here. No, it's like usually I start around 5 a.m. But the the new 5 a.m. is an hour earlier. So basically, it turns out to be exactly the normal gaming time. But my running streams always start later <laughs> you can nap for 30 45 minutes i think i'll be here still before i have to start doing errands you're like uh holding up the fort together i'm okay for now cloud thanks for the offer though Yeah, so really old group of friends. We stayed in contact. You know, some of them are my my best friends still. Met them uh, 27 years ago or 29 years ago. I don't know. It's crazy. And one of them was in the Olympics in Beijing in bobsleigh for Team Canada. I brought my blanket though off my bed. I'm all nice and snug. Nice. And did you ever get those groceries delivered, Epic? Are they coming today? store kept declining payment they haven't updated their system to the new standard my bank uses oh so what are you gonna do man <laughs> that really blows do you have any other options A mood. Hey, welcome, welcome, Attila Terzo Fan 7. Right now I'm running at 10.4 kilometers per hour. And uh, for a marathon, uh, would be a bit faster than that. I don't know kilometers per hour. I think it's 12k per hour. Like my real marathon pace. 
is five minutes per kilometer or I think this is exactly 12 kilometers an hour but right now I'm training this is a slow low heart rate run Welcome in though, Attila Terzo fan, seven. Yes, do, do, you, uh, do you run too, Attila? 12 is really fast, hello Epic. Well, thank you. I used to run as a fast sprinter when I was younger, until puberty law. <laughs> By the way, do you drink water while running? I don't think I've noticed. Yes. So, under 25K, I just drink Gatorade, and that's, that's fine. Over 25K, like today, Usually when I jog on the treadmill, I can't do that unless I walk. Also don't like the feeling of water sloshing around in my tummy. Okay, so I have one sip every two kilometers. So there's no sloshing around. It's not a big quantity. And as you get used to running, you have no choice. Uh, so yeah, over 25k, I drink water instead of Gatorade, but every 45 minutes-ish, it, 45 minutes -ish, I'll have one of those gels, and it, it's about like 100 calories of carbs with a little caffeine. So... Mixing that with Gatorade would give me like uh, like stomach issues. <clears throat> but yeah, under 25k, I, I don't usually use gels. It's like not really worth it. I think I've seen Chris run more than I've ever run in my entire life. <laughs> Man, we all gotta start somewhere. So, mine, my running story starts in 2015 where we had a Destiny 1 uh, or fire team or whatever <laughs> at the office and then we had we're missing a sixth player and we're trying to convince him to get a PS4 with Destiny which is a big investment like to buy a whole system for one game to play with work buddies so one of the other guys said, if you buy a PS4 in Destiny, 
Chris is gonna run a half marathon. And I read, I never really ran before that. <laughs> and he did get a PS4, so I had to register. And I had like 12 weeks to train for my first half marathon. That was uh, 2015, so almost seven years ago. And I never really stopped running since. So, thank you, Destiny. Destiny the game. Not the path that's created for you in life. That is a crazy reason to have started running. Yeah, man. But you'd be surprised. A lot of runners start because of a bet. Like they lose a bet, they have to do a race. I know many, many. Not necessarily gaming related bets. Man, I just started jogging because I wanted to stop. Panting, going up, lots of stairs. <laughs> Any reason is good. Dave Barista from Gardens of the Galaxy. This man is an imbecile. <laughs> what a Thank you so much, DJD. I really appreciate it, brother. What up, howdy, howdy. Yeah, check him out. Playing Heavy Rain. Are you still liking that game? It was such a good game. Really, really good. So like impactful and stressful because you want to do the right thing. All right, six k. Cheers, guys. Thank you very so so much for the sub, man. Is that the game when I scared you with the sound alert? Yes. That's funny. Yeah, I really want to do the insert clip. Shout out. What up, KeyCat in the house? How are you, KeyCat? You're more than welcome, man. You're an important member of Chris's community. Most definitely. And thank you, Epic, for doing the shout out because it's a bit hard to do those while running, for sure. <laughs> How would you even shout people out if Epic wasn't here? Just at the end of the stream, I guess, All right? <laughs> he would shout out in real life. That's true. Shout out DJD. You should follow him. We love him and you will love him too. He was last playing blah 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 check him out <laughs> follow cloud she is cool and maybe a neighbor will hear <laughs> like really loud wake up my kids here you go shout out keycap playing genshin impact i love them you should do 
I'm super surprised she's playing Genshin because she never plays that. He does not see it. Thank you, thank you, haha. <laughs> Shout out, Cloud. Playing Hades. Blah, blah, blah is my favorite game. <laughs> No more shout out. That's the second one. <clears throat> What's Genshin? Who really knows? It's a little uh, indie game. I redeemed the Quebec accent. Oh, really? All right, thanks. I need to find a way to make those appear. Because what I see is what you guys see if you put it in full screen. I don't see anything else. Hello. Uh, thank you, thank you. Uh, I didn't want to ignore it. It's just because I only see the chat. If it's not mentioned in the chat, I cannot see it. I don't know if uh, there's a way to have the uh, event scrolling, but uh, 6.5 miles, I ran that in my entire life probably. No, no, no. Those are kilometers. Kilometers because uh, you know, I'm in Canada, I don't use miles, you know. Canada is like Europe, but uh, I guess the UK, you can tell us, uh, Epic, uh, do you use kilometers or miles? Sounds like India accent. Oh, that's funny, I never heard that. To my ears, it's very different, but uh, I mean, it's an inter interesting thought coming from a, an American, you know. So that's pretty much it. We talk like that over here. Uh, yes, no toaster. Yes, madam. We like to eat a lot of poutine, you know. I can drink my coffee while this is happening. Officially, it means to be kilometers but everything is still signpost as miles. I have no idea why. He redeemed my dad joke. Okay, make one up on the spot. Uh, you're a dad. Uh, okay, it's even better this time because he's wobbly, wobbly Quebec. Uh, I'm crying so hard because miles are better. Nope, not really. I hate miles. It's uh, all right. Two minutes up. Now let's think of a dad joke. Uh, so, my friend, my friend is very tired of me invading their privacy. At least. That's what I read in their personal journal. Can I redeem? Yeah, for sure. Go nuts. You just have to tell me about it. Because I won't see it. Yeah. Go ahead. Are you doing 27 kilometers right now? Yeah, that's the plan. 27K. Please verify, I trust you guys. All right. <clears throat> okay, so uh, she sells seashell uh, by the seashore. The shell she shell are uh, usually, uh, uh, surely seashell, so uh, if she sells the uh, shells on the seashore, I'm sure if she shells seashore shells. Confirm. Confirm. You saw it here first. You know. Bring up another one. Hi. I love it that uh, you get a kick out of that accent. You know, uh, it makes 
It makes warm in my heart because that's how I really speak uh, for real. I just put up a show with the American accent uh, usually. How much wood uh, would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? I think I think this is supposed to end up with could chop wood, but uh, I may be mistaken. And I have no idea when this two minutes end. So uh, we could try to uh, analyze. Pipple Piper Pepper was so great. It really was. And uh, <clears throat> we could try to see if uh, my heart rate good goes higher or lower with the Quebec accent. It might be a secret edge, you know. I would chuck, could chuck no amount of wood since a wood chuck can't chuck wood. No, he can't apparently. He cannot with the tiny wings. <clears throat> you know, he cannot hold the, the axe like this. So we're just missing Johnny in here. But if a woodchuck could chuck and a woodchuck would, how much wood could a woodchuck chuck? We're just missing Johnny for the tank top club. Shout out. Actually, my heart rate went up. Slowly approaching eight kilometers. Watching a run is making me tired again. <laughs> and I'm just having coffee. Well, last time it made you hungry. Peeper Piper at your windows. A scary thought. Oh no, you said hungry. Now I'm hungry. <laughs> Get this man arrested. Peeper <laughs> <Yeah. clears throat> Piper. <sighs> I'll go get some bread. Later, Cloud.
and I'll get a, a yummy salty caramel gel in one kilometer. Did you hear Ubisoft and Guerrilla Games ragging on Elden Ring? Well, no? What's happening? I like this song. Nice. Did you know what prior keycap? It's sugar coffee. Or a square coffee. I do not. Alright, so. I think you can see the title. It's a bit small, I should make it bigger next time. But all the music during this stream is by uh, Stream Beats by Harris Heller. And uh, he, uh, he lets you stream his stuff even on VOD and there's no problem. So it's really cool. I think they're jealous of the Metacritic score. SME employees took on Twitter all pissy calling out of the UX design and lack of tutorials. Oh yes, it's just small because I'm on mobile. It's probably fine on PC. Yeah. So, <clears throat> if you want to stream music, uh, without any risk, Stream Beats is a really good option. <laughs> yeah, that's too bad, uh, Epic. Seriously. You know, they're so different games. Some people like to be more handheld, like me, and some people like to figure it out themselves. There's enough room for both of these types of games. You shouldn't... You shouldn't diss anybody else. Ever. Like, I'm sure even the people that tweeted that don't feel so good after doing it. The tutorial is get good or don't play. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, I was surprised to see professional say that kind of stuff. I expect it from random jerks on Twitter, not from actual game designers. Yeah, seriously? But yeah, being negative like that will always bite you in the butt. I've seen this commercial of a, a can of Coca-Cola. Uh, oh no, no, it's a can of Pepsi with uh, 
a, uh, a Coca-Cola cape. And uh, the, it's a Pepsi commercial and the sub subtype is, this is gonna be a scary Halloween. And Coca-Cola answered with the exact same image, but wrote, everybody wants to be a hero. That was so good. I can send you a link to the video I heard from. It's only a few minutes long. It's worth having a good look at your leisure. Sure, man. If you can DM me on Discord, you can post it here too, but it'll be harder for me to get back to it that way. Oh, I forgot about my yummy, yummy gel. It's not even salty caramel. Oops. This is tri berry. They're not as good. Yeah, thank you. Long. Let's try not to have sticky fingers after that. Alright. Later, Kit Kat, thank you. I'm back with bread and a chocolate chip banana muffin. Can't believe I'm saying this on a fitness stream. Yeah, man. It's all good. We all gotta eat. Cheers. Lavish model life. Scrining a bunch of baked goods. Oh wait, be right back. Because I'm getting a fork. <laughs> I had McDonald's breakfast for dinner, so. Oh yeah. They do 24 hours breakfast. That's cool. I really like their, I think they're called neck griddles. So it's like a breakfast sandwich in between two pancakes and maple syrup. No, it's leftovers. My meal prepping from yesterday. I'm horrible. <laughs> Hatch browns are just amazing though in general. It's hard to mess them up. Man. <laughs> I couldn't agree more. We, uh, we're pretty lazy. So we have like a four slice toaster and we just throw them from frozen into the toaster <laughs> two or three times until they're crispy. <laughs> and they are amazing. Just at once, the toaster was starting to be a bit dirty. So I put it a bunch of time at maximum under the fan so that the smoke would go away and it caught on fire <laughs> from all the hash brown oil. Yeah, we have potato waffles over here too. That's how I do them. <laughs> nice. I'm in zone three. So it's a bit too high. That means next week or in two weeks rather. We're gonna still be at this pace. I'm gonna keep on this pace until it really becomes an a true easy pace. 
Uh, I can't get any faster than that for the moment, unfortunately. You'll get there. Yeah, thanks, Epic. I just gotta be more consistent. I've been taking two long breaks in between like my, my peak uh, cardiovascular shape. All right, 10K guys. had a pretty bad week in terms of diet started out fine when I spoke to my dietitian but after that kind of went off the rails and to get back on it starting today there you go epic you got this It's a bit over the top, but I think potato waffles. <laughs> yeah, look up bird's eye potato waffles. I support you, Epic. Yeah, man. We all do. So, yeah, it's a bit over the top, but I, when I'm not doing so good, I just write down everything I eat. And then before eating something bad, you're like, do I really wanna write that down? It makes you a bit more conscious about what you eat instead of going rogue and not counting anymore. I, it just works for me, but everybody has their own tricks and you got this epic. It would be a shame to to waste that beautiful hair of yours. So, you gotta, you gotta become healthy to match the hairstyle. Yeah, it's just been a bunch of takeaways this week and some chocolate biscuits. <laughs> All right, but that was the past epic. Today is the future. <laughs> Don't pressure yourself too much though. I believe you'll get there. Yeah, man. That's true, Cloud. Are you getting tired, Chris, or are you still okay? 
I'm pretty good. It's way better than last week. Last Saturday, I had way too much to eat and drink. So like, food was slushing around, you know? <laughs> this week, I, I behave more. I've been eating like super healthy smoothies and big salads that fill you up but are only, only filled with good stuff. I think the gels help you have a little boost too. I would have thought the added talking would mess with your breathing patterns, make it more difficult. Not that I want that, just a thought. Crazy. Such an impressive thing to discipline yourself to do. Yeah, Epic, that's definitely true. Uh, it does make it a bit harder on the heart rate to be talking. That's why I told them initially, OMG, I don't want to make you talk. But uh, <clears throat> that blue zone, like a, a slow run, is actually called a conversational pace. And if you're not able to talk, that means you're going too fast. So I'll slow it down before stopping to talk, you know. When I do my intervals on Tuesdays and Thursdays, they're like short runs with speed bursts. I couldn't be talking through them. I'm just surviving, watching The Mandalorian, and like holding with every little part of me, waiting for the interval to end. It is hard. Happy March 13, everybody. You're doing great conversationally. I'd be weeping in and dramatically <laughs> lit corner, rocking back and forth from this. Thank you. what he said. <laughs> Quick camera cuts of extreme close-ups and beads of sweat running down my brow. 
Oh, trust me. I've got plenty of sweat on my brow. That's why I use the towel so much. And last week I dropped the towel on the floor. So I had to reduce the speed to like walking speed. Grab it real quick, real quick and start again. sweating because you're running. My sweat would be from pure <laughs> paranoia and terror. Oh, by the way, my daughter, my oldest daughter, helped me choose the intro and Be Right Back songs. So I can't wait to show them to you. They're also from Stream Beats. I don't want to jinx it, but what happens if while you're running, you drop your water or calorie gel? I'll slow it down to like four kilometers per hour. At that speed, I can jump on and off. I doubt it'll happen. Just know I'm clumsy AF. And that'll probably happen to me long. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm good. The towel is like, I just need to center it and it's gonna hold. The other two things I really dropped. There's like little cases 
or casings for the water and gel. We should be good. Your, your dancing emotes. Sketch where a dad took ecstasy <laughs> tablets at a rave. That's funny. My hate pops. Thank you so much for the follow. What a nice surprise. What is up? Welcome, welcome, my hate pops. the muffin and the bread and the coffee that all sounds really good just realized this is what you're listening to while running that's insane always listen to k-pop for energy <laughs> k-pop huh no, I was looking for something we could listen to together. Uh, it's pretty good. My mom baked the, muff baked the muffin and it pairs well with the espresso with, with milk. Nice. So yeah. I needed music that I can leave on the stream and VODs. So I filtered all of their songs for uh, BPMs that are in the right running range. And I filtered out some of the songs that were like either holiday songs or that were way too mellow. Consistency matters more than bursts of running. Yeah. Stream some Elden Ring for a couple of hours yesterday. Zero chatters the whole time. It's hard when that happens. I'm so sorry, Epic.
I'm sorry I didn't see it. I would have come at least say hi and leave a lurk. Like, don't hesitate to either DM me or at everyone in your Discord. And like, if I can, I'll leave a lurk and say hi at least. And if I'm not busy, I'm gonna stick around. But uh, I turned off the Twitch notifications because I had too many. Uh, that's fine. It's a me thing. Should be streaming regardless of numbers. Yeah. That's still. Regardless of that, I'd like to support you better. chat with others so when it doesn't happen keep thinking I could have just played this offline on my own well yeah but you can see it as if you're just turning on a, a switch and as if you're playing online until people arrive hey y'all what's up coffin mama What's up with you? We're all hanging. Yo. Having a good time, I hope. Great name, Coffin Sama. That may have not been what I said. <laughs> Just that your name appears in blue on black, and uh, I have trouble reading it. Coffin Sama. This motivates me to get back in the gym. I've been slacking lately. Coffin Sama, this is exactly why I stream my long runs. If I can get a, just a couple of you to be more active, then it's all worth it. Yeah, that's a little better. Pick me up song for the 14K lol. Let's go! I wish they were all like that. Over halfway there, dang. That's true. I hadn't realized. Cheers. Thank you, Captain Sama. It's Stream Beats by Harris Heller. This totally sounds like something from a Sonic game. Yeah, huh? Running after the little golden rings.
Jim Rajon at one. Yeah, I need more of the songs to sound like that. I need to check out uh, Johnny's library to see if there's any uh, energetic songs that you wouldn't want mind me streaming. What time is it? Where are you from? It's 6.27 a.m. We just uh, moved the time forward uh, this night. So it's like I as if I woke up at 2.45 instead of 3.45. Chris does more before 8 a.m. than I do in my own <laughs> Come on, Kikat. Maybe in terms of running only. Honestly, haven't slept yet. <laughs> uh, you're not alone, Coffin Sama. Hey, does Twitch help reach you a wider audience for training? Tips? Highway 2470G. Uh, I don't know highway. I am in no fashion a fitness instructor. I'm just a, a runner with a lot of uh, enthusiasm and I hope to made it motivate some of you, but like take all my advice with a big grain of salt. <laughs> But yeah, like I, I love streaming, but I also love running races and like <clears throat> I had to choose between you're a yoga trainer and considering Twitch to reach out to more people. Oh man, if, if you're an instructor, definitely try it out, you know, you have Absolutely nothing to lose. But yeah. In my case, it's like both ways kind of. For sure, especially because people can just wander on Twitch stream a lot easier than wandering into a gym studio. Yeah, definitely. You can teach all of us yoga. So, yeah, I had to either skip the Sunday stream because I usually game every morning and stream it. I'd love to. Let me gather the courage to go live. Hey, Coffin Summer. Wow. Thank you so much for the gifted sub. Wow. Gets easier every time. Shout out, Sama. Seven days to die. Nice. Plus a new follow. Thank you so much, Highway. Only thing I know about yoga 
Is it lets you breathe fire and teleport? <laughs> Yoga flame! Yoga! That's true. But thank you so much, Sama. And highway for the follow. Appreciate it. So yeah, sorry, I'm awful at like keeping track of what I'm saying because look, I mainline the Hausen in Street Fighter 4. I took yoga in high school, but they made us run two miles before every class. So by then I just go into corpse pose or child's pose for the rest of the class, trying to support in whatever little way I can. Yeah, thank you so much. I think I know a thing or two about how yoga works. I'm gonna head to bed now. Hope you have a great stream. Thank you for the motivation. Much love. Bye, everyone. Thanks so much, Sama. Take care. Good night. could either, either take breaks on Sundays and go run alone or keep the fun of streaming and connecting both gamers with fitness and people that look up fitness on Twitch to connect with our gamer friends. So, so far so good. It's super fun for me. It's extra motivation for me too because it gets long running alone. You could add fin fitness tags to stream as well. Yeah, I should do that. Thanks, KeyCat. To attract fellow fit people for now, you're stuck with unfit mods. No, no, no. <laughs> you're so funny. helps my motivation to to have you guys along and like I can't abandon if you guys are watching You're like nah 16k is enough let's call it quits for this week that's not an option if you guys are here hating at all but how do you stream for like five six people and not get demotivated as in if I were you I wouldn't stream because there's so few people I'd rather just practice on my own without worrying about the setup and answering questions 
Oh, so much love for your effort. <laughs> Highway. Like five or six people watching it is double my average. And I'm very comfortable with those numbers. If there's no one, I'm still doing what I like. Every single extra viewer above zero is bonus for me. <clears throat> my average is like 3.2. And one of them is me. <laughs> so I'm actually impressed with the numbers today. Also, I'm not in it to become big or make money. I'm here for fun and to make new friends. And like, just a little bit of advice, Highway. If you don't already have an audience on Twitch, be ready for a couple of streams where there's no one. No worries though. takes things in stride others may get very offended followed you on insta too to keep in touch stay updated thank you they did say they weren't hating just curious Also, genuine question. Love Chris answers. Also, I think I think Keycat is also right in pointing it out just to avoid offending other streamers that may take it differently. But no worries. I didn't say they were hating, just I'm also not hating, but some things are better left unsaid. Imagine someone quitting streaming. <laughs> they are asked that, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I give up. Like this zone is the best guys. It's probably gonna get harder towards the end. Seems a bit of an extreme reaction to a question. They are determined to make it succeed. Probably had to enjoy five, six viewers for a while. I don't know if I frame the question in the best way. 
first answer was great and helpful. All right, guys. I think we've explored the topic enough. Only 10, not arguing, just conversation. All right, all right. <laughs> Thank you, Kika. Thanks for the lurk, I appreciate it. Only 10k left. Try to gather some more info to get my Twitch started eventually. See you later, Chris. All right, thanks so much. Take care, highway. This is why Raymond stopped talking to me. I don't know, Epic. I love you, man. I know you don't do it on purpose, but sometimes you come off a bit intense and it wasn't like a bad intention at all I know definitely you're like such a nice guy but like calling her reaction extreme could be taking the wrong way all I said was highway wasn't being rude Well, a comment or whatever, you did use the word extreme. I'm back, just fed my dog, but I'll have to leave again for dinner. Was meeting in person, stopping streaming, 
is an extreme reaction to being asked. Oh, gotcha. Then I read that wrong, Epic. Thank you so much, Cloud. Have an amazing dinner. Also, bread and muffin right before dinner. That's a pretty cool uh, meal plan. I can see confusion that I wasn't saying cat was being extreme. Yeah, no worries, Epic. I was getting nervous. That's all I can say. That's the the vibe I got. Not necessarily just from your side. I just get nervous whenever. Even though it's a super nice argument, it wasn't in a super jokey way either. So I, I was getting nervous and kick at bounced. Like I had no linking anything I said was intense so for this to turn out like that is surprising to me question can be seen as rude. The person was new to Twitch, <clears throat> it's fair to let them know that it can be seen as rude. If they were to go around asking people that, it would not be nice. I had to take care of cats. Okay. It's my bad duck. Apologies, guys. I can easily get nervous. Nah, I started that. Sorry, guys. Wasn't arguing with you. Wasn't calling your reaction extreme. Yeah. This is so beautiful, guys. Thanks for clarification. I did take that wrong. Yeah, it would be extreme to quit streaming because of that, but... <clears throat> I know that when I was new to Twitch, I was asking Ed some questions that now thinking back, they were not, they were not really nice questions. Just saying the hypothetical streamer stopping from being asked that, yeah. You know, like, when I was just getting into watching streams, you see numbers from all around. And then you see someone with like, oh for sure, I've seen it happen almost exactly like that. They are on the last straw, may very well make them quit. Yeah, that's sad. 
But yeah, like I would go to Ed stream. Just usually in general Twitch etiquette is not to mention viewers, <laughs> especially lack thereof. Yeah. No. For me, six, five or six is awesome. And like, I used to go to Ed's channel and see 15 and like, I was trying to be helpful, but I was like, how can we help you make that number bigger? And that was so rude of me. And after a year of streaming, I see that 15 is crazy good. Yeah, 10 plus is top 1%. Exactly. And I was like, ah oh man, let's make that 50. So, super, super rude of me. He didn't know better, better. Just like that person didn't know better. Yeah, told them, used to do the same thing. <clears throat> same as like new streamers coming in and right away saying that they, they stream too, is a no-no. to be firm with that to be honest so they will see you as a spot to advertise prior to their stream yeah Getting there, it's like eight kilometers left. stepped away and came back to this conversation, learned something new. I don't really know what happened, but I like you even more now, Kikat. Personal preference, but I don't really like being shouted out. The stream is about streamer, and it almost never results in a follow anyway. Should I stop? Stop what class? <laughs> yeah, you're over cloud. Quit Twitch. It's fine. Just a me thing. Yeah. that way I don't mind either way found a lot of good streamers through people shouting them out yeah for sure
You gotta start somewhere. You can keep shouting anyone you like out. I shout people out too. Just never seems to benefit me when I get one. So I prefer the streamer to get that attention. Yeah, I'm sorry you had that experience, Epic. I wouldn't say the ratio is super high, but I did definitely get some followers that way. The most recent example being on a, on Cloud Stream when she shouted me out a couple of days ago. I think Tuesday. I did get a couple of followers. Thank you, Cloud. I mean, it's you who told me about Cloud Underwear. <laughs> I never would have known otherwise. Yeah, I've had a few, but like 99 of my followers aren't viewers. They just follow me randomly and never return ball. Like, <clears throat> culotte apparently means underwear in French. What up, Nilly? Yeah, underwear cloud or cloud underwear. Hey, Epic, how goes you? <laughs> hey, Chris, hope you've been well. Yeah, Nilly, how about you? Do you used to be called Nick Knack Nilly? That must be you. <clears throat> I did, yeah, but then decided to go back to just Nilly. Sweet. Welcome back. Told you spelling defense is locked in alongside their definitions. What? Another piece of trivia just sitting there. Ah. 
culotte, t'as une culotte. For sure. Quebec accent from K Cat Bud. Okay, again. Uh, so on the clock here, I will go until uh, 1945. I mean, uh, I'm a bit more tired than before, so uh, you're getting the tired Quebecer. I hope you like it too. He's a bit more sweaty and. Uh, cannot talk as much but there's only uh, six and a half uh, kilometers left so let's not give up let's go let's go potato tomato let's go let's go kikat from culotte which is filipino for curly but I wanted to spell it culotte for some reason and now French people will probably find me odd. Did you see? <laughs> let's go, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Potato, tomato, you know. One tea locked in. All right, so I'm starting to become a little bit tired, but uh, let's not give up. We can do this. I'm trying to imagine running for an hour straight, trying to think of what I would have to be <laughs> chasing me. Well, for a whole hour, you know, uh, not a lot of animals can run for a whole hour so uh, it would have to be uh, some kind of a very slow bear my apartment is like 400 square feet i barely have to do that all right so that was a tired quebecer but on that super interesting topic, I read a book called uh, Threading Lightly, and apparently that's how like humans used to hunt. Like they would they would charge. Uh, like we're not the fastest, but we have the longest cardio. No animal can jog for like jog slowly for four hours so they would run towards under the toe so they would run towards like big beasts like buffaloes but if they try to take them one on one they would for sure die but if they just like throw rocks and keep running for like two hours then the buffalo would just fall on the ground dehydrated and then the human would kill it and eat it for the whole village so like slow cardio is part of our survival what up with the raid topaz thank you so much heard something that used the front of their feet for that spring and being quiet. Nice. Hi. Thank you, Topaz. Thank you, KitKat, for a shout out. I need a little water. Dark Souls Remastered. So there's like 
half an hour left already thank you guys so so much for like hanging out the whole time that's insane hey there chris running for canada now yeah man team canada i made it to the senior team ages 70 and up they didn't look at my id So you joined the seniors? Yeah, man. I'm obviously kidding. Dark Souls recently. What's the script with Elden Ring? Is that only a specific days? They didn't look at my ID. Yeah, I just showed my hair. two hours now so this is 16.77 miles yeah I'll go back to Elden Ring just felt like I need to finish DS now because everyone's playing ER and don't want to Watch spoilers. That makes sense. I don't know when you converted Keycat. Is it the twenty seven K? Or where I'm at now. Because I think you need to divide by like 1.6. And I'm in no shape to do mental calculations right now. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah. We're getting there. There's like 5k left.
Also, when playing a game, I can't pause, so we'll be in and out chat. We're almost there. Hey, thank you so much, Kika. We appreciate it. I was gonna say, shout out to uh, Soul Treadmills, S-O-L-E. I find them to be like, I'm not sponsored, I wish, uh, but I find them to be a really good bang for your buck. Like, they don't have as many bells and whistles, but they're built like a tank and like, You've got like a lifetime warranty on the motor. <laughs> lifetime warranty on the motor and the frame. And they're really sturdy. <clears throat> it's not every treadmill that you can run like that long on them without them overheating or something. I'm really happy with it. I might start myself at least a half hour yeah absolutely you can even like speed walk in front of a show depending on what's your starting level of fitness my wife did a couch to 5k my family have a workout room that's awesome so my wife went from zero to 5K with a program, never used it in years. Today is the, the start of the new Utopaz. Fifteen hundred calories. What up? My fitness level is slowly waddled to the bathroom or kitchen every few hours. Is that a trademark? <laughs> All right, so that's 23K. That's what we did last week. So four more. Trademark, copyright. You see my heart rate is starting to be high. Like zone four is too high for a long run, a long slow run, but uh, I'm not gonna give up in the last 4K, but this is starting to be uh, tough.
23. Let's go, let's go. Ah, that's a good one. I'll allow this tentatively. The only thing I would worry about is if my boobs would reach my knees. <laughs> if I start running routine for months and not permitted the term. <laughs> That's so funny. Being thoughtful, epic. I was blocking chat, but you can edit all that yourself, Chris. Sounds good. But I trust your judgment. Just don't block the term Chris. That would be rude. <laughs> Please don't. Twitch said I permitted it. I'm saying I don't. I'm letting it through because I want. It wasn't malicious. Ah. So don't abuse it until we block it again. I gotcha. <laughs> She's taunting you, Epic. All right, I need a better pick-me-up song at this point. Come on. Three more kilometers. That's what a sports bra is for, I'm guessing.
have never thought of that. I asked for a better hype song. <laughs> I'm gonna fall asleep. That music is cool, yeah. Just you want your heart rate a bit lower, yeah, chilling and spark wise. I just need a little help for the last mile. K left. You got this cruise. Water? Yeah. I'll have water in a minute or something when I hit 25k. Run no limit in your head loop by two in the minute. All right, let's go for water. I missed the the screen. That's better. The Scottish parody version of No Lager. Alright, 25k, do it, do it, do it! That was well timed, Topaz. Two more kilometers. Come on.
Thanks for the hype, though, Baz. Let's go. This is the last mile. Yeah. Party, party, party. Killing it, man. Thanks, Epic. Thank you, guys. <clears throat> Final stretch, let's go. I'll take water at 26 for the last K. Yeah, but I think I screwed it up around kilometer 18 where like I took my gel and forgot about the water or something. So I've been winging it a little bit. All right, 26, one kilometer left.
What a legend. <laughs> Thank you so much, Epic. Nearly there. Pretty sure that's the most uh, we've done on stream, right? Epic. I don't remember the first two that were pretty sp spaced out. It was like 20 something. Five K. Okay. Nice. So new stream record. <clears throat> what? The bones. Thank you so much, Tio Paz. Super nice. <laughs> For your stream record. <clears throat> Thank you so much. I appreciate it, Topaz. New lap record. Good job. Muchas gracias, amigos. You told me to quit it. Yeah. Epic is strictly prohibited from just gifting more subs. He gave 10 two weeks ago and five last week. So. And by the way, nobody's expected to help that way. Your presence is, senor. Yeah, your presence and support and raids, all that means a lot more to me. <sighs> like, today was a pretty insane chat. It's probably the most chat I've seen and my stream ever. I love it. A third of a kilometer to go. You're there for the finish line, Cloud. Let's go. going well. I have to admit, I'm a bit tired, so uh, I'm happy we're almost done. Like 200 meters left. Let's go. hard and I can't wait for it to finish if that sounds better are we gonna hit it the next time the mileage comes around it's gonna be close 
Carried in two more weeks, it's good to finish. <laughs> no worries. Thank you. Like my hands are tingly. I need to put the fan even harder next week. <sighs> Thank you so, so, so much everybody in the chat yeah hallelujah and i'm seeing like angel halos everywhere <laughs> Feels good to walk it off just a bit. You might be having a straw. That's funny. Uh, I'm good. Uh, like this song would have been useful during the run. So, what's everybody's plan today? Who's gonna be a tiny bit more active today? And that's okay if it's after your night, because some of you didn't go to bed yet. But hopefully you get to move a little today or tomorrow. Do some daisy. It just made me more tired. Ah, thank you so much, guys. It's afternoon here. And no excuse, Topaz. Hit that family gym room. I thought I had dinner early, so I got to witness the finish. Yeah. Thanks for coming back. What did you have to eat? Fantastic effort, as always, man. Thank you, Epic. You were there the whole time, and you didn't fall asleep. Epic, thank you so much. Upbeat song hit during cool down. Yeah. It's like, where were you? Uh. Sleep is silly. Sonic the Hedgehog again. Cool down zone, act three. <laughs> uh, I definitely need my sleep, DJ. Like, I even need it to be pretty consistent. Even going to bed like two hours later than usual, I'll feel hungover for half of the day on the next day. I don't know what's actually what we can call it Mongolian. And it's a mix of rice, noodles, beef, chicken, squid balls, and vegetables. Thank you. Uh, tw 27. That's really cool. Thank you so much. Feel bad. Uh, yeah. That's really cool. Thank you so much. Uh, chicken squid balls.
So. <sighs> it's obviously like too late to play Horizon. All the next running stream are gonna be just running. Uh, so I'm just gonna cool it off like one or two more minutes and then hop in the shower, start the day. We're going skiing today. It will be crazy if you stream now though. Gotta wake the family up. Have breakfast. I'm gonna have one of those. Huge. Yeah. Yeah, man, just get your shower and chill before skiing well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So far, it, it, it wasn't on purpose, but uh, hope your day goes fantastically, man. Thanks to JD. Same to you. God bless. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye for now. Thank you, Topaz. Uh, I, I haven't done it on purpose. Glad I was able to catch you for a bit. Yeah, man. Appreciate it. Super cool. DJD. Uh, I think I might do some Beat Saber now. Yeah. There you go. I really want to try that. I'm waiting for the PlayStation VR 2. Never tried VR before. So whenever PS VR 2 comes out, I'm gonna buy it day one and try everything I missed out on. Uh, yeah, I, di I didn't plan it that way. Take care of yourself. Hope you don't get dizzy. Uh, so far, three running streams followed by skiing. Three weeks in a row, but uh, it's not on purpose. We just choose the nicest day to go ski and it's been Sundays for three weeks in a row. So that's why. But uh, skiing is not really the same kind of exercise at all so it's really no problem all right i haven't tried psvr definitely intend on getting it as soon as i can nice so which which one do you have djd what do you play your beat saber on is it the Quest? Something like that? PSVR is great and PSVR 2 will be great improvement. Nice. You have the PSVR Epic? Nice. Love the Quest in spite of the Facebook connection. Yeah. I've heard only good things of the Quest. Quest, Quest 2. Pretty cool. You bought a Rift day one, that's awesome. I wish I had. I just like was didn't have enough time to game back when those came out. So I like I couldn't keep up with my normal games backlog, so why add that? But I feel like now's the right time for me personally. But a quest day one, yeah. It's a hassle to set up though, but PSVR 2 is like a single USB C cable that you plug in, yeah, right in the front of the PlayStation. So that's gonna be awesome. And then they give the quest away. Give the quest away to get the quest 2. Oh, so you bought three of those machines, DJD. <laughs> That is insane. It's really cool. Yeah, I'm gonna jump on that next train. I don't know when it's gonna come out, right? Like when, probably 2023. 
Imagine like the riff was so, so pricey at launch and now it's not even sold directly anymore. Yeah, that's technology for you. Um, yeah, what would be insane is like a 360 degrees treadmill with one of those. Like it, it would have to be like a lightweight headset, like what I'm using for running, because you would sweat in it. But like having a like a running simulator that you have like zombies running after you, and you just have to run away, that'd be pretty cool. Apparently, there's like an audio app on your phone that does exactly that, that'd be wild, yeah. So like you can hear the zombies getting closer if you slow down, like the phone will track how fast you're running and you can hear the zombies catching up to you so you have to run faster. It's just audio but it's still pretty crazy. And the other thing I, I thought about that would be really awesome is like a Pac-Man game on Google map that you run to like grab the points and run away from ghosts but uh, like looking at your phone while you run is bound to end up in some accident <laughs> yeah right I think I downloaded that app and then never used it <laughs> Yeah, same. I just heard of it, but never tried it. So you're, you took it further than me about, at least you downloaded it. I came back about you talking about running from ghosts. Excuse me, what? Yeah, I said it would be cool to have a Pac-Man game with Google map that you run around streets and streets and, and like grab grab those little dots and run away from ghosts. I don't think I'll ever be able to sleep. Ah. All right, I think I cooled down enough. What's my heart right now? It's 111. Google Lens version, all the Pokemon goers Prove that phones are deadly. No need for phone. Yeah, Google Lens. Exactly what we need. I don't know why they pulled it out, right? Where is that? What happened to Google Lens? It was pretty expensive too. But like that's when they come out with one of those good ones. It's going to be awesome. All right. Thank you so, so much, everyone. That was really, really cool. Let me transition to my desk and try not to cover it and sweat too much. I'll put the Be Right Back screen for like one minute while I change the microphone that's plugged. And that way you can see which which uh, be right back song my daughter picked, and then uh, we'll say goodbye in 30 seconds.
All right. All right. So yeah. So was that was that better? I know the other one was a bit too ravey. I think my mic's too too loud. All right. So yeah, I hope it's an improvement cuz I got uh I got told that like my my streams my streams were super super chill and then I I put uh is that your home gym? I don't know why I assume you were at a community gym. Good choice. Love that you got bop in there. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, no, 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 no. That's actually like the treadmill is is right here. Um So yeah, it's like my my office is like a six by six cubicle kind of in my gym. So the gym's over there and my office is right here. And uh, yeah, it's like my man cave. Yeah, my exercise, gym, gaming, working room. Like if I had if I had a a fridge and a toilet, I could never leave this place. <laughs> All right. Total trillionaire, come on. No. No, no, no. I'm just lucky, like my 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 employer gives me uh like like a good amount for either fitness stuff or home gym equipment like they want us to be healthy so they're like here you go here's like a thousand bucks a year to spend on gym memberships and yeah i know i know so uh my dad's garage is basically his private house now <laughs> yeah 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 uh, it's all good, but all all the gym equipment it looks like a lot, but I've been with with them for fifteen years uh and instead of huh, you put a fridge and power and a bed in there, that's pretty complete. It's like a bachelor pad, so yeah, instead of paying gym memberships, I've been slowly building the home gym. All right, thank you so much, guys. This has been. A real, real pleasure. Seriously, thank you so much for keeping me motivated like that. We'll be back in two weeks because I'll be uh, visiting the U.S. next week for ski. Uh, we're going to Mount Killington in Vermont. Uh, every time I go to Vermont, I think of Super Troopers. I don't know if you guys have seen that, but it's an awesome, awesome movie. <laughs> you know how fast we're going, sir? So he could basically live there and work on his race car and never leave. Yeah, that's that's really cool. I don't know how you don't look like a mess right now. I'm actually jealous. Lol, lol yeah, absolutely always a pleasure. Ah, uh, thank you. I am sweating bullets. Uh, yeah, men are so lucky. <laughs> All right. You have an amazing day. I love every one of you. Peace out. Thank you so, so, so much for the support. It made it much easier. Peace.